Greetings and salutations, you guys. It's Hayden here. Welcome to a new video. How's everyone doing today? Because all doing fantastic. I am here today in the city of Anaheim at the Goodwill. This is the one on Lincoln, I believe, is where it is. If you guys love thrifting, thrift hauls, vlogs, and all that fun stuff, do not forget to subscribe to the little bell button so you're notified when new videos do go up. Add me on Instagram. It's Hadrian, just like it's spelled here. And check out the shop. It's Hadrian.com to see whatever sale for my thrifting adventures. Also, check out the live sales there every Friday and Saturday night. And I do a giveaway every night as well. And it's super duper fun. I love chatting with you guys. And I feel like we just have a super fun time. I also have our link to the discord group down below in the description box if you guys want to join i love being able to chat with you guys and you guys can chat with each other and i have different like uh different what are they called threads where you can leave questions about handbag rehabs or authentication questions and myself or one of the thrift squad can help you out i feel like to, all together we just have like this super vast collection of knowledge and it's amazing and i love it but anyway Without further ado, let's go into the store and see what we can find. Let's go. All right, let's go to the store. Let's go inside. All right, walking in, we got some stools. Nice. Perfect for a small. Let's go into the next store. The counter. Oh, look at this. This is cute. It's like the end of the bed. Or like the living room or something. That's fun. Looking at the bag that they have on display. Right here. This little side table is cute. On this console, it's still here as well. This is a Studio Mickey one with collaboration with Party. <gasps> oh, look at this. That's cute. It's like a blue. It's almost like a denim, I think. We have some Christmas trees, cutting boards, cleaning supplies. What is this? Neutrogena Fresh Foaming Cleanser. We have these Myers Clean Day things. The last time I was here, I actually got my new phone case. So now I'm just like on the hunt for more. iPhone 12. Oh, they have these Philip Hue. <gasps> But they only have one. I always wanted to try one of those. Have you guys ever tried them? I know like there's cheaper ones, like alternatives on Amazon that you can buy. They have these Philips Norelco's. Oh wait, they have more Philips views. How much are these? I can't see how much they're selling them for. I wonder. Oh, I see. Let's see if we can find any handbags today. This leather? No, it's just like quilted. Um, this one is a BCBG Max Azria. This one looks a little Balenciaga-ish. It's a Stone Mountain USA bag. I think it's a coated canvas. Ooh, this looks like a Dagny Dover. Is it a Dagny Dover? Dagny Dova. Let's see. Um, it's twelve ninety nine. I think this is a Dagny Dova. Hold on. I need to get my bearings. Oh yeah, it's a Dagny Dova. Cool. It's have a no. It doesn't have the crossbody strap. That's cute though. Okay. I think we'll get this for sure. I like the color too. Exciting stuff. Let's see, do we have anything else? Got a Target bag. Oh, there's little like velvet bags. Kind of interesting. Um, Talbot? Uh, it's a Talbot bag. Okay, Talbot. What is this little? Fruit printer bag. Oh my gosh. <gasps> How cute! It's a little Lego spaceship bag. I'm gonna look this one up. I guess that is how I'm gonna look at this bag. What's this guy right here? Stone Mountain? Is this another Stone Mountain bag? It is another Stone Mountain bag. 
Oh, this one's cute. <gasps> How cute is this with little bugs? This one is a Steve Madden. Actually, they're kind of cute. I think that's it for the nine bags. So. All right, let's see if we can find a cool wallet or anything. This little wristlet's kind of cute. I think this is like a little pleather one. Um, case logic, little camera case. This looks like a hobo wallet, but I don't think it is. Yeah, I don't think this is. This little Salvatore Ferragamo makeup bag. Alright, I think that's it. Adrian, Ritadini. This <laughs> I just keep looking anyway. Uh... Ooh, this turned into a duffel? It's a Target bag. Um, what is this hat? Tightness? Alright, let's check out the rest of the store. Let's look at the shoes really quick. Since we're here already. Uh, they're kind of cool looking. They're gone. Oh, they have one of those. You know, I got one of those before. I feel like those poofs don't last long with us because the kids just like destroy them and then they get like sad looking. <laughs> and then I left it outside and then it got really dirty. So. Pillows. Any cool specials? <gasps> this is kind of cute. A little fuzzy star pillow. $2.99. Wow. Hmm. But maybe no? Maybe yes? Oh, they have these masks. I'm gonna get four of them for a dollar. Actually, I'm gonna get eight because my mom <laughs> asked me to buy some more for the boys. Oh, they have different prints. Oh, those are good fellow. Oh my gosh, how cute is this little- Oh, it's a candle! Okay, this is like cute though. Ten bucks. Jungle wood rose scented candle. Oh, I wonder how it smells. Okay, why does that actually smell pretty good, but it's like ten bucks? This is kind of chill. Nicole Miller, 10 bucks. I like this. Okay, I went back over here first. <laughs> I wanted to make sure they had those masks really quickly before anything, before I forgot to get them. So, got the masks. Now let's just go back on a regular route. You guys like that too? Like, do you guys have like a regular route that you go to? I don't know. I feel like I always have to go like the same exact way, especially at this store. I'm strange. Creature of habit, I guess. Okay, I turned the mic around because um, I feel like it's always facing the wrong way when I'm at the store and I feel like you can barely hear me, so I apologize for that. I always forget because I was using a camera that didn't have a microphone like this for a hot second and I switched back to this camera and yeah, so. But here we are, back in the right direction with that Leica oh interesting okay we don't see anything in the backpacks and bark it's actually a pretty nice backpack magic twist hairbrush buns for dreads and afros I wonder if I could use that on Eliza they moved all the baskets over here oh my gosh how cute it has like a little tea set Oh, how fun. Is this for like dolls? Um, Schling, made in China. They're like literally so tiny, but that's so cute. Oh, is this real? Oh, these are real, they're like dried. Are these real? No, but this is real. All the little vases and pots. 
This one's actually kind of cute. This is Target one. I like that print. Now I want to see what they put over. Oh, hold on, it's over here. Ooh, I have that red glass vase, but I have it in like a large version in kind of like a, you know, like when they recycle glass and has like that green tint. That's what the one I have looks like. We have some starfish. These are real too. Real starfish right there. Is this a, oh, warm apple pie. Mmm. Is this Bath and Body Works? I don't know, but it might be. This candle smells so good, vanilla and shortbread. It's $2.99. It smells amazing. It's been, I don't know, should I get this? Oh, this is one of those re reusable Keurig things. $7.99, that's expensive. This little orange thing is kind of fun too, 99 cents. Oh, oh, they kind of just like expanded these like little tchotchke section, like the wood tchotchkes and boxes and stuff. Oh, this is actually, oh, this is cute. This is from Target, I think. It's a tray, oh, $17.99. This is cute. Should I get this? Oh, is this Pottery Barn? Hold on, I'm getting excited. Let me just put that up there really quick. Um, not Pottery Barn, I think. Uh, Faze, MDF, Jetta Max. I feel like my mom has one of these, though. It looks very Pottery Barn-esque. Little drawers. Okay, don't need that. But this, that's cute. Should I get that? What do you guys think? Oh, gosh, they also have this little, I don't need this. It's like smaller. I love this because I love the length of it. And also, this is just to roll with it. La Cucina rolling pin with wood handles. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. $6.99. Ooh, look at this. I wonder if it's... I don't think I see a made-in thing. I'm looking for some sort of, like, ice bucket. Oh my gosh, you have this squeaky balloon dino. How cute. This is pretty. Oh, it's... Is it broken? No. Oh, it is. Wait, no? I like that, it's like square. I think it's like chipped though. I feel like it kind of stabbed me in the side. You hey guys, look what I just found. It was like over here underneath. This is one of those fake toy Dysons. Oh my gosh, it is so cute. I think these are like actually work too. Like I don't know how strong the suction is, but that is so cute. I don't know if someone got it for Christmas and they donated it, but it's only $7.99. Totally gonna get this. Oh, they have these pretty glass Christmas trees. I don't want to get anything though. I don't want to have to store anything right now. I just put all the Christmas stuff away. So I'm trying to be strong. Ooh, for recipes. Okay. I'm just like looking through the glassware and stuff. That cake stand is kind of cool. So is this one. Very like... What's like the vibe of this? Like Art Deco? Is that what that is? I don't know. Let me know what it is down below. Okay, I feel like I've seen all those things before. Uh, any cool plates? Oh, I was like, does this have holes in it? But it doesn't. It's like kind of like an optical illusion. $2.99. It's like kind of cool. Uh, don't see any plates. Oh my gosh, my aunt Gloria, I don't know if you guys remember, we were like thrifting with her like last week and she was looking for plates. Tell me why she found some amazing Pottery Barn plates when she went thrifting by her house. Congratulations, auntie. <gasps> Wait, Pottery Barn. Oh my gosh, the Pottery Barn has rubbed off. These are like this pretty like eye cat print. These are gorgeous. One, ooh, two, three, ooh, is this another one? Four, five, six. 
<gasps> are there any more? These are pretty, but there's only six of them. I kind of want eight. They're $1.99 each, which honestly is not too bad. What is this? Threshold? These are kind of cute too. I love the color. The shape is fun also. World Market. Christmas. Okay. Do I need these? I'm trying to be strong. Like, I don't need more plates. I'm going to be strong. They're cute, but they're kind of pricey. And there's only six. And one of them doesn't match. Circa. Ooh, I'm a sucker for a flower. These are melamine, though. On this Starbucks mug, which is pretty cute. It's $4.99. It usually sells like around $20, or they sell them for around $20-ish. I guess it's from their 2016 anniversary collection. So, I think I'm going to pass, though. Let's see if we can find any other cool mugs or cups. Oh my gosh. These are so cute. The penguins are killing me. It's missing one, though missing one that's a bummer this is also so cute the little oh why am i such a sucker for those kind of cups anyway it's missing one don't need it then it's fine it'll be okay target mug target mug this is also target yeah Ooh, look at this with like the Skeleton. Ooh. Happy Halloween skeleton mug. Oh, look at this. Starbucks. Interesting. It's missing the spoon. Oh, that means these are also Starbucks, right? They're all missing the little spoon, though, which is a bummer. But there's, like, a couple of them. The spoon looks like that. This isn't a Starbucks one, though. Oh, anthropology. Letter E. It's not anthropology. It's tricking me. It's a dupe. This threshold set is kind of cute. Ramekins. Buere. Oh, how cute are the little dogs? Beagle, Pug, Puggle. Oh, this is from Fish Eddie. <gasps> Look at this pizza plate. Ooh, someone made this. Fun. Every time I see this, I think it's so cute. I love this little bear mug. $3.99. Little container with music notes from Circa. Ooh, they have these Pottery Barn star plates. Hold on. I saw one here last time and it was cracked. But these two look to be intact, but this one is $2.99. Should I get them? Where's the other one? Looking good. Hmm. Should I get these or should I just wait? I don't really need them and there's only two, so... Oh, these little potato things are fun. Ooh, what's this with the cherries? Sonoma Life and Style. That is really cute. Rachel Ray. Oh, these are cute too. They kind of look like mushrooms. $2.99. Look at a little metal tree. Kind of cool. Little desk. Anything here? Anything hydro flask? Oh, hydro flask. Mm, this one's like really beat up though, unfortunately. But Hydro Flask nonetheless. Oh, hello kitty. How cute. I always like to look at the cookware too, just in case there's anything that may be of interest. Haven't seen all the. Okay, if you guys have found any Lake Crusade recently, please let me know. I know like during the live, like I asked you guys, and a couple of you guys have been finding a lot of Lake Crusade. Especially someone who just recently found a large Le Creuset frying pan. Congratulations. And to Chantal who found Le Creuset at the bins. I am so jelly. What is this? This is like a giant thermos. Oh, Aladdin steel craft. Ooh. 
You just bring that coffee with you. Hey guys, okay, so we are back at the house. I'm super excited to share with you guys what we ended up getting today from the thrift. I got some pretty good stuff, and let me show you. All right, let's start off first, though, with I bought a ton of masks for my nephews. They were, like, four for a dollar, so I went crazy and bought a bunch of them. Um, actually, I just bought eight, so I didn't go too crazy. <laughs> but uh, I think each one has two masks inside, so... That's awesome. So a total of 16 masks. These are fantastic. They're washable and all that goodness. And these are actually Target masks. They're from Cat and Jack. Kids reusable face masks. So pretty excited. I bought a couple already before and the kids like them. So I got some more. They always need more masks. Then inside of here look at this mug i'm so excited it is my favorite color <gasps> it's yellow ah! it's beautiful uh, it matches the yellow part of my uh of, of my shirt anyway this is a parker lane um cup i don't know if these are are these sold at target i, I don't remember where parker lane is from regardless of where it's from it's really really cute and um, I think this was like 99 cents, so it was really, it's a really cute cup. I'm very excited about it. I love the color. I'm so obsessed. And it looks kind of like the green ones that I got this past, uh, like holiday season from Starbucks. And so I'm very excited. So I can't wait to use this. Gonna drink some coffee out of my yellow cup. It's so beautiful. Okay. Is anyone else's favorite color yellow? Like, let me know down below in the comments. Am I the only person? I feel like no one ever says their favorite color is yellow. I feel like I'm the only one. And I have loved the color yellow ever since I was little. It's like the color of sunshine. It's like the color of happiness. It's the color of Pikachu. So, like, what's better than that? So I got that. Pretty excited. Oh, I got another mask right there. Gotta give those to my sister. Um, and then I got this little hydro flask. Stinking cute. I always get these little ones just in case, like, Eliza or Zach, like, lose their cups or whatever. And I always get them. And Eliza and Zach have never lost their cups. They might have left them at school by accident, but they always find them. Um, Kay's actually the one that always loses them. So... Yeah, but this was $3.99. It's a great color. It's just a little dirty. I mean, it just needs a little washing. And, like, the top, like, it's still in great shape. Uh, plus, I have uh, a couple, like, lids for these with a straw. So, like, Eliza, like, I don't even have to buy a new top if I wanted to use the other one. Uh, so, yeah, this was fantastic. Very excited. And $3.99, you can't go wrong with a Hydro Flask. Love that. Then... I got this Madewell. This little Madewell tote bag. It is cute. I love the color of it. It's like this. It's like a taupe. Like a taupey, light taupey gray color. It has little drawstrings on the sides. Top handle. There's a interior zipper pocket. It's super cute. Uh, adjustable, removable crossbody strap. So... Madewell totes are, like, the jam. I love them. They are fantastic. And I just want, like, a large, like, one of their extra large um, leather totes. Maybe, like, in a tan color or, like, a yellow. That would be fantastic. But leather. But their canvas ones are really nice, too. So, got that. This one was... Okay, I think I took the sticker off. Oh, here it is. It was st stuck to the bag. It was $6.99. I was like, where'd it go? I swore I just saw it. So I got that. And then, um, last but not least, I got this Jagnormous Dagny Dover tote. This is like their laptop or travel tote or something. There's like a laptop pocket inside of here. It's padded. It zips across the top. Um, it does have the D-rings for a crossbody strap, so this is missing the crossbody, but you can easily get another one online, like on Amazon or something. There's a million compartments inside. It even has, like, a large, like, cup holder thing to hold, like, your, um, like, a water or whatever. There's three built-in pen pockets, a two open pockets, a zipper pocket on the other side, more pockets. So lots of compartments. It's made out of like super durable coated canvas and then leather handles. So this is fantastic. This bag is great. It's 
like the perfect work bag, school bag, travel bag. I love the drop length too of the handles because it's a nice length and the handles are like nice and sturdy and they sit really comfortably on your shoulder. So if you had this bag packed with a ton of stuff, it's not gonna like dig into your shoulders intensely because the straps are really nice and distribute the weight nicely. So um, this one was $13 right there. And yeah, that is actually going to round out our little haul for today. Hope you guys had fun checking out the store and what I found. If you guys enjoyed the video, please give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to say hi down below in the comments, especially if you guys are new to the channel. Welcome. I'm so happy to have you guys here. Welcome to the Thirst Squad. Uh, tune in Friday and Saturday nights at 10 p.m. Uh, for the live sales. They are super duper fun. I love chatting with you guys. And we do um, giveaways every night as well. So it's free to join. And uh it's exciting. So um, consider joining if you guys are available those nights. And uh, I do post videos every single day. So the new video is going to go up tomorrow by early at 7 a.m. I'll see you guys all in the next one. All right. Bye, guys. Adios.